New tonight, a Sherwood couple coping with the devastating loss of their four year old daughter after she was killed earlier this week in a car accident. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Laura Monteverdi. KRK's Hunter Hoagland talked to the parents who are now praying that some good will come from this tragedy. In every home video, just keep swimming, just keep swimming. Abigail Cooley wore a smile. She was always smiling. She was always happy. To her family, she was just Abby. She loved to dance, play dress up, and laugh, as most four year olds do. The only time she was ever sad was she had eaten vegetables. Her mom, Chandler, says Abby was their world from when she opened her eyes for the first time to when she closed them for the last. I never thought I'd ever have my life without her. Abby was in Texas with her dad when a driver who police say didn't slow down rear-ended them as they sat in traffic. Obvious standstill had you couldn't miss it. She was airlifted to the hospital with severe brain injuries. Her parents say she fought for two days before dying on Wednesday. October 14th at 10.05, she was pronounced brain dead. Sullivan says it hurts to know she'll return home to Arkansas without her only child, but she's now finding comfort knowing Abby's light will continue to shine. She's going to be saving like eight kids with just her organs. The four-year-old's lungs will help a new child breathe, and her heart will beat for another. Knowing that there's going to be another kid with like her heart, and that potentially one day I can listen to that, that keeps me going. It's a second chance these parents wish their daughter had. Instead, clinging to home videos and memories, knowing this smile will help others one day do the same. Abigail was the light of the world and the best little girl that I could ever dream of. And Sherwood, I'm Hunter Hoagland.